Geordie Shore star Gaz Beadle has split from his wife Emma McVeigh after two years of marriage. The reality star, 35, took to his Instagram to share the news with his followers as he took part in a Q&A on Monday. One fan asked if he was still in a relationship with Emma to which he replied, No, we actually separated about three weeks ago. We are still friends. There is no bad blood or anything. We have worked out the best way of doing it for the kids, which for me and Emma is always going to be the most important thing. We both deserve to be happy as well as being parents. Gaz and Emma have two children together as son Chester, five, and a daughter called Primrose, three. Emma has yet to address the split on her social media. Gaz, real name Gary, is known primarily for appearing in the MTV reality series Geordie Shore from 2011 to 2017. In 2015, he appeared in the second series of X on the Beach, and later returned to take part in the All-Stars fifth series in 2016. The pair married in July 2021 with both their children watching them walk down the aisle. The ceremony took place in Cheshire with 90 people in attendance. The couple had been together for three years before getting engaged in 2019. It comes after a difficult year for Emma who had to have a life-saving heart operation in January. The model and influencer had open heart surgery to mend three holes in her heart and her trisky pit valve, which controls blood flow between the right atrium and right ventricle. After Emma told how she was terrified of not seeing her husband and two children again, sharing that she'd mentally prepared herself that they'd said their last goodbye when her family dropped her off at the hospital. She told the son of her ordeal, they came to the hospital to drop me off and Gary had to drive away with the kids crying their eyes out after we said goodbye. That was the hardest bit. I had to mentally prepare myself that it could be my last goodbye. I knew in surgery I'd be connected to a heart machine too that would be keeping me alive while my heart was stopped. And I kept thinking, they're not going to be able to start my heart again. I thought, I'm going to get put to sleep and I'm not coming back out. Emma, who was born with three holes in her heart, also opened up about the tough recovery from the six-hour operation, which left her struggling to move and in immense pain. She said, I had a big tube in my neck with lots of wires coming out. I couldn't sit up or move on my side and because the morphine made me sick. I didn't want to press my morphine button so I probably wasn't taking as much medication as I should, which added to the pain. However, Emma's recovery suffered a major setback as she then suffered a collapsed lung, which then triggered a surgical emphysema, which is a rare lung condition which sees air become trapped under the skin. The beauty soon recovered, however, and six days later she was allowed to return home to her family. In the aftermath of her procedure, Emma took to her Instagram where she expressed her gratitude to the medical staff who helped her through her difficult time. She penned, I came into this month with a healthy heart. I'll never be able to thank my surgeon, doctors, nurses, and everyone else involved. I had two small holes, one large hole in my trisky pit valve repaired. They've given me a new life to enjoy with my babies and really don't get the credit they deserve heart suit. I've come so far since this photo two weeks ago. Right after this was taken, I was crying and throwing up all over myself, unable to move. My brother and mum just swapping buckets under my chin. Day two, I cried from the pain, trying to take a deep breath in and cough. Day three, asking how I'll ever be able to get myself out of bed. Here I am now, I left the house yesterday and watched the kids play outside on their bikes and I've never been happier.